Hi, and welcome to the Home Assistant How-To with Bearded Tinker. Today, we are going to configure Social Blade Sensor. We'll start in 10 seconds. Social Blade Sensor gives you information about a YouTube channel. So, who would want to use this sensor? For example, if you have your own YouTube channel, or if you are a fan or follower of somebody, you may be interested to track how their subscriber count is rising or falling. So, Social Blade Sensor can give you information how your favorite YouTuber or your own YouTube channel is progressing or doing. The integration for the Social Blade Sensor is pretty straightforward. First thing that you have to do is you have to go to the Social Web website and you have to find your favorite youtuber so for example let's say dr z's and here you will see the statistical information for the dr z how many uploads subscribers video views what country he has declared his um, living in when the account was created plus some additional data as to number of subscribers, number of views weekly, trends, etc. For this integration to work, what you need is you need to have this user ID that Social Blade is tracking and you have to copy it. Let me find my channel. Okay, so this is Bearded Thinker, this is my channel, as you can see, Statistics are almost the same as Dr. Z's. This is my number and I'll copy it. Next thing we have to do is we have to go back to the Home Assistant. In Home Assistant use either Visual Studio Code if you have it or you, if you are using it or Configurator. Let's open our sensor YAML file. I'm currently inside of it. And here we will create new configuration for the new sensor. So it will be social blade. Name of the platform is social blade. And the only additional information we have to add for configuration of the sensor is channel ID. Channel ID is that URL name that we copied from the social blade. So for me, this is this one. Okay, this is saved. Let's go to configuration, server control, check configuration, and let's restart our home assistant. Okay, our Home Assistant is back. Let's go to Overview. And we can now create visual representation of our server, of our sensor. So let's create new sensor. Social Blade. Okay. Let's see if we can... No, we cannot get graph because we have this K. Unfortunately, YouTube changed the way it gives the information about subscriber count. And now it only includes uh, three digits, so three the leftmost digits. Let's press save. And here I have information about my YouTube channel uh, subscriber count. And this sensor, unfortunately, it will be a bit harder to track it in terms of the value because it is not a number, it is a string. Probably you can do manipulation and remove the last character and get the number from that. But it's also nice to combine it, for example, with the uh, Home Assistant Community Store integration with the YouTube. Where you are able to pull the current information about the latest video from your uh, YouTuber. In this example, we are pulling the information about the latest video from Frank. But this is it for today's Home Assistant How-To. I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, 
please give me a thumbs up. If you have any kind of a comment or a question, you can of course ask it down below in the comment section or you can join us on the Discord server. If you still haven't subscribed, please subscribe and hit the bell button so you get notified on the future updates and I will be seeing you next time. Until then, bye bye and have fun.